So, this is the 1981 Mako 490. And to start this bike, currently, it's got a tickler. See that? So, I've been able to start this bike. So, uh, 82 has been impossible to start like this. That's why it has a carbine with a choke. And I did make another video before that, well, perhaps I would put, you know, this carburetor on, on the bike, see how it is. At the same time, I do like the bing. It's just hard to start. Now, this bike though, I actually have been able to start this bike with the bing. What I typically have been able to do is, I can push this down for 10 seconds, do like four priming slow kicks, push it down for another 10 seconds. By that time, it'll flood out then. I do another five priming kicks, and then I hold the throttle wide open and give it one big kick and it starts. So, now there is a trick to starting uh, big bores that I was using on the KTM 495. And that is, you can take off this air hose here. Uh, if it comes off here. Um, not the air hose, sorry, the overflow hose. Take out the overflow hose, put another hose on top of it, and blow in for 10 seconds. And my KTM 495 start every single time like that. So, instead of flooding the thing out, I did that. So, I want to try that. And see if that, that works on this bike or not. I know that I can start it with the Bing. In fact, it's the first bike I've ever been able to start consistently with the Bing. Um, but, I don't like the flooding out of the carb and uh, holding the throttle wide open and flooding it every time. Seems ridiculous to me. So, so I'm going to try that technique of blowing in the carb. Let's see if it works. Saw it right there. I actually did start up. 
I did blow a little bit too hard though. Got some gas out of it, but I didn't have to hold it wide open. You know, every kick it was starting to start. I just had to I think I went a little bit too much blowing, but fired up. So yeah, this bike is pretty easy to start. I started it using the tickler and I started it using the blowing in the carb method. So that seems like it's a pretty strong runner. So yeah, so there you go. There's another weird trick to starting these big bores. <laughs>